It's the Daily Dog. Hey, y'all. Welcome back to the Daily Dog. Thanks for being with me today. On today's episode, my friends, we are going back to the German band Rammstein, and I am excited uh, to get back to this band. This will be my fourth uh, reaction video to music by Rammstein. Previously, I have listened to Radio and Deutschland and America. And today we're going to be listening to their song Zona. And this one comes to us via recommendation by our good friend JJ. Thank you, JJ, for sending this in. Glad to finally get to it. So, uh, Zona is uh, a song from Rammstein's third studio album called Mutter, which means mother, and it was released in the spring of 2001. Uh, and I think that I have heard a little bit of this song before. There is a piano-based version of this song included in the end credits uh, for their music video for Deutschland, but this, I think, will be my first time hearing the proper tune and I'm looking forward to it. Uh, Till Lindemann has said that this song was originally uh, written as an entrance song for the boxer Vitaly Klitschko, but I don't think that that usage ever panned out. And apparently, uh, in the music video that we are going to be uh, viewing, the band members play dwarfs, and uh, there is uh, Snow White. So this is kind of an odd retelling of the German fairy tale, Snow White. So I'm, I'm looking forward to, to hearing and seeing this. So we've got Till Lindemann on vocals. Richard uh, Crespi is on lead guitar. Paul Landers is on rhythm guitar. Christian uh, Lorenz is on keyboards. Uh, Oliver Rydell is on bass. Uh, Christoph Schneider is on the drums, and for this particular song, they have Olsen Involtini doing the string arrangements. So I am ready to dive in. I've got my keyboard nearby in case uh, we, we want to play along a little bit. I will be uh, uh, looking at the original uh, music video for this. So let's take a look at Zona from Rammstein. Off we go. I zwei. Right into it. Drei, vier, and he's counting. Fünf, that part six, of German vocabulary I remember. Seven, <laughs> At least my acht, first ten numbers. Nine. Nine. Aus. Aus. Aus is out, not ten. That's big time. They're in D. Yeah, but um, that's that sounds like a yeah, try it. Die Sonne scheint mir raus die Augen. Sie wird heute Nacht nicht untergehen und die Welt zählt laut bis zehn. Okay. For the chorus. Here comes the sun. It's the brightest star of all the stars. Here comes the sun. It's quite different than uh, George Harrison's version. <laughs> Low D is like a bell tolling. Cool. Down, down. It will not set tonight. The sun will not set tonight. And the world counts loudly to 10. And they go to a different key. They're in B. B minor, they go to from D minor. C down to B, right? So he's using B minor 
using a flat and second uh, note, almost like making a B Phrygian. And I read that this soprano isn't even a real singer. That's just a, um, a patch. It's a digital voice. And I haven't been paying attention to the video. cool tune that was it had a lot of stuff in it a lot of stuff um okay um <laughs> it always happens with this band you know they uh it there's just layers upon layers upon layers of meaning especially when you when you uh factor in the visuals that they provide in these really fascinating music videos um it's been a while since I studied my, my German, <laughs> y'all, and my vocabulary is a bit uh, out of date. But this one's not too hard uh, for me to, to get around, and, and I did find a translation to help me out a little bit. Uh, they start off by counting 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and then out. And then it's into verses and refrains, and the refrains are coming back to them counting. 1, here comes the sun, 2... Uh, here comes the sun three it's the brightest star of all of of the stars and uh and as we go on it was hard for me to figure out what they're talking about here what's the what's the bottom line what's the uh what's the underlying thing that they want us to think about they it seemingly they always have that in their minds uh with their art with the songs that they put out in the end I, uh, I think it's a song about finding balance and, um, and moderation in our, in our lives. So Zona means sun. And uh, I think they're talking about it literally and metaphorically here. And it's something that's ever present in our lives. It provides warmth. It provides sustenance. It provides energy for growth, but uh, too much of it. <laughs> and it can cause drought. It can cause death. It can cause withering. It can cause pain. Uh, I've had a few sunburns in my lifetime. They are not fun. And so maybe the counting in the song, which I found a bit odd, uh, maybe it's a mechanism like a timer that uh, is there for us to enjoy and embask in, um, uh, in the sun's energy, but, but not for too long, and don't overstay our welcome. I mean, at the end, uh, they say aus, meaning out, right? So it counts down or it counts up, and that's our time with this particular uh, sun. And whatever metaphorically that may be, uh, including the real sun. And so I think uh, in the video, it looks like they were miners uh, for Snow White, who then I think overdosed on what they, or overindulged in what they mined. And then in the end, uh, the apple comes down and can be, uh, like the sun, uh, life-giving and reaffirming and, and can start us all off again. Uh, fascinating these guys uh have such depth to uh their to their music and uh you know political personal ideological 
uh, kind of a humanist, a worldwide view, and and I really have been taken by um, the the production in their music. Uh, every time I hear it, it sounds absolutely great. That was so heavy, but it was expertly mixed and processed and and put forward for us all. So wonderful uh, piece from Rammstein. JJ, thank you for uh, submitting this to, to me. I am sorry that it took so long to get Rammstein back on the channel, but I am happy to have uh, indulged in their music on this World Wednesday once again. So thanks to all of you for hanging out with us today, and we will see you next time on another edition of The Daily Doug.